Hey everyone, I hope you're doing well. I know it's been a while since we've posted on this channel, but we're going to start making videos again, starting with this one, where we're going to analyze some important data, as well as look at some upcoming events that may affect the U.S. market with a quick recap on the Dow Jones. So last Friday, the Dow hit about 31,000 after rallying around 2.5%, while the leaderboard looked fairly mixed, ahead of a very significant week of earnings reports. Snapchat in particular crashed pretty hard this past week after uh, missing earnings expectations due to competition from rivals like TikTok, which absorbed a lot of their ad revenue, and this caused it to hit lows around 7.33 before consolidating a little bit later on that evening. And at a moment of such high volatility, the industrial average is testing a very key resistance slash support area that we have seen before, right around 31,000. Meanwhile, in the UK, inflation rates have passed 40-year highs in the middle of a cost-of-living crisis. And the US is looking at an FOMC meeting in the first and second of next month, with the CPI values being still super high, energy around 20%, and the cost of food was up to about 125 to 13%, while the cost of all items was around 8 to 9%. So Jay Powell is expected to raise the interest rates again at this upcoming FOMC meeting with these uh, CPI values in mind. And Jerome Powell should be taken pretty seriously, especially whenever he says things like this. If inflation were to move up in ways that are unwelcome, we have tools for that, and we will use them. No one should doubt that. And even still, with several interest rate increases this past year, the Fed has missed its target, clamping down on inflation. Perhaps one of the hardest hit sectors has been the U.S. housing market, which over this last summer has declined substantially in some of the most prominent districts. Another thing to pay attention to between the end of November is the unemployment rate, which right now is pretty good, but is expected to go up a little bit as we get the data related to corporate layoff season. The next meeting is going to be November the 4th, and this report is released every Friday of the month. The last thing I want to do in this video is kind of talk about where we may be headed in this current market, and to do so, I'm going to put into perspective where we are now compared to where we were just a couple of years ago. And as you see, uh, before the pandemic, we were trading right around 28, 29K, before crashing down to around 18,000 at the pandemic low, before the Fed ramped up its stimulus and quantitative easing tactics. So with everything in consideration, I personally believe that the Dow may break under 30,000 as we move into the month of November, as many of these aspects have not truly been factored in yet, and the market is still trying to react. So that's all I've got for you in this video today. If you found this video useful, please give it a thumbs up as it helps our channel a lot, and let us know in the comments where you think the market might be headed.